I didn't feel a part of this culture. Mm. And I think that that had to do with the fact that I was missing some, there were some gaps in my understanding of what black culture was. So this series for you was a self-discovery project in a yeah. sense. It was, it was self-exploration. My name is Rohan. Um, I'm a visual storyteller. In a sense, you know, I was very shallow when it came to, to black culture, to African American culture, to understand who I was as an African American. It was like, yo, soul food, you know what I'm saying? Christmas, Thanksgiving, Easter, you know. Um, For you, it was, almost, fashion. it was almost surface level. It was very surface level. It was very surface level, yeah. And then you go to your family and they can't provide you with any answers either. Mm. But that's why this project started because it was, one, as an artist, Art is always used as a tool of legacy. So I decided to use that same concept to create these portraits for individuals in exchange for their stories. When I was in fifth grade, I remember going up and meeting my grandfather and my dad's side for the first time. Dealing with domestic violence in my home was probably one of the more traumatic things in my life. And then use those stories to kind of tell or, or paint a picture of what the culture is and, and, and the people involved in it. And then I gave them the portraits because what I wanted to happen was for them to hang those portraits and for them to be able to pass that down to their children and therefore create a legacy. You no, know, some of your portraits, though, are not of so-called everyday people. You know, the Barack Obamas, the Maya Angelou's, the Toni Morrison's, the Marcus Garvey's, the Huey P. Newton's, the Angela Davis's, the Muhammad Ali's. All of these people are setting precedents through action and sacrifice that the rest of us, you know what I'm saying, are lucky enough to have to follow. That's so important because the celebrities create one aspect of the culture and the everyday people create another aspect. You almost have people who are the, the trendsetters and the innovators and you have the people who are the supporters and the people who are the, the pushers, you know what I'm saying? And when you put them together, then you have a bigger idea of like how things actually have gotten pushed and accomplished within black culture. I'm trying to push culture forward by um, creating a platform for, for people to tell black stories, to, to showcase themselves, to, sh to display themselves to the world, and allow people to see how beautiful they are. Black and beautiful, too.